Hey what's up guys, today we're gonna hide the navigation bar on Android devices. Doesn't matter what device you're on, Pixel 5, Pixel 65, whatever, it's still gonna work. So the first thing you wanna do is open the Play Store. Go ahead and type in FNG. Install it. Alright guys, go ahead and swipe through. Next up, go ahead and enable it, turn on, click on the accessibility service, turn that on too. And as you can see here, you guys can use gestures so you guys won't lose any functionality of your device. So to hide the navigation bar, click on the hide navigation bar option and then follow these steps. I'm going to be granting with my PC, so you guys are going to need a Mac, Windows computer, or Linux system. Alright, before we do any of the commands on your PC, go ahead and go into System. Actually, go into About Phone and become a developer by clicking on the build number four times. I'm sure you heard this 20,000 times already. Now go back to System advanced and then developer options scroll down until you see USB debugging or something like that mine just says Android debugging make sure you turn that on alright now we can go ahead and switch to the PC okay now you guys should go into the description of the video and click on the platform tools link you're gonna be brought to this page and you get three options to download Windows, Mac, or Linux. I'm on Windows, so I'm going to download the Windows. Agree, and then click download. I already downloaded this, but once you guys download, you should unzip the file into a brand new folder and go ahead and open that folder. So here I am. I made a new folder called Flash, and I went ahead and put the Platform Tools folder into that folder. So here are the contents of the Platform Tools folder. You guys want to click on the drop down arrow at the very top and then copy the path. Once you copy the path using control C, go ahead and open command prompt. Click on windows and then type in CMD. And then here you have it, the command prompt. You can go ahead and close out of the platform tools folder. Now type in CD and then type in the path we just copied. Control V should do the trick. Here we are, you want to click enter of course, and then you guys want to go back to the description of the video and then go ahead and copy down the ADB command. Once you copy down the ADB command, and then paste it in again. This time, it should be success. If nothing pops up, it means the command went through successfully. If something happened, you guys probably need to go back on your Android phone and go ahead and click on allow. Once you click on allow, type in the command again, and that should be it. We can go back to our Android phone. Alright, now it should say disabled, and then click on three button navigation. Now your navigation would be gone. And that's it guys, you still get functionality such as a back button, home, etc. So go ahead and enjoy this new feature. Oh and by the way, if your phone is running Android 10 and you have the gesture navigation turned on, go ahead and go into settings and then switch it back to 3 button in order for this to work. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out.